Annyeonghaseyo! This vlog of mine is very informative for those Korean food lovers. So watch out and join me how to make this Napa cabbage kimchi. See ya! And for today, I'm going to show you how to make my forever favorite Korean side dish, kimchi. So this is what we all need for our kimchi. Napa cabbage, radish, carrots, onion, ginger, garlic, sugar, of course your hot pepper powder, glutinous flour, fish sauce and your salt first things first you have to cut your whole napa cabbage into quarter just like this or if you want your kimchi to be sliced already you can cut like this an inch thick so I'll do both Half of this one and half of cut. After cutting your cabbage, you have to brine it with the salt. This is the salting stage. Every corner you have to put salt. Mix it well with your hands, with your clean hands. To properly salt the cabbage. And then set aside for 10 to 20 minutes. Cut your carrots into julienne cut. For your radish, cut it into julienne. So after that, I'm going to sprinkle salt on my carrots as well to brine it and to my white radish. So let this sit for about 5 minutes only and then you can wash it thereafter. So this is how it looks after brining into the salt. Your radish and your carrots. See, it was cooked by the salt. That's why it's so like the texture are now different. Okay, it's now time to make our kimchi paste. Pour your hot pepper powder. I use one half cup of hot pepper and it's up to you if you want it more spicy or just a little an average spice and then I use one third cup of sugar if I want it sweeter or you can reduce the sugar and then one fourth cup of minced garlic And one fourth cup of your fish sauce. Since I don't have green onions or like the spring onion, I use white onions. I want more of onions, so I put the whole. You can just use half of it. But for me, I will use whole. You know what? 
and then you can put your brine julienne cut off carrots brine julienne cut off carrots Afterwards, you can put your white radish. So since I want it more spicy, I'm going to add more. I'll make use of half cup. Oh no, another half cup. If you don't have the Korean uh, chili powder, you can just use any kind of chili powder as long as it's red. <laughs> I'm using this like I'm using this Indian powder only. And then add more one fourth of your fish sauce. And of course another third cup of your sugar so just mix that all up so we just have to mix this all up I will use my hand but I'm using the gloves better to use a big bowl since I don't have any I'm going to use this one. Can you see that? Mm, I can smell kimchi. I can smell yummy kimchi. Look at that. So red. This must be spicy. After mixing it properly, we're going to wash our cabbage. Wait, I almost forgot my minced ginger. It's just a tablespoon of ginger to add a flavor. Then mix it. And after mixing, you can put your sticky rice flour, your sweet glutinous rice flour. I'm using this one to get the, you know, the sticky feels of my paste. So just mix it just like that. So after 20 minutes, 10 to 20 minutes, wash your cabbage properly. Remove the salt. For your kimchi not to be salty. Too salty. the cabbage after making your kimchi paste it's now time to put them all together so let's do it this way just spread it evenly you see that spread it evenly on the inside each corner Every corner, ah. every corner you have to put. Why not use my hand? I'm wearing gloves. Spread. 
spread them on every side of your cabbage to get in the flavor so that your cabbage gets the flavor can you see that it's so pretty now this looks so pretty Can you see that? Does it look edible? Is it? <laughs> Does it look gross for you? No, this is solid. I'm telling you. Just a disclaimer, I use everything clean, what I use are all sanitized and I'm wearing gloves while mixing this all in my bare hands so you don't have to worry, it might look gross in the camera but it's not, this is neat. So there! So there you have it everyone! This is my kimchi, presenting my kimchi. Let's take a look how it turned out. Kimchi, yogiso, yogiso, hanatu. Kimchi made with love by yours truly. I know you are all drooling with this kimchi. Want some of my kimchi? <laughs> Thanks for watching! See ya! <laughs>